Hi, I am Hussain, Senior Transport Modeler at PTV Group. Today, I'm going to show you how to import your GTFS data to PTV Visum. I will start with an empty version file in Visum that contains no data. And I will go to File, Import, General Transit Feed GTFS. In this window, I need to allocate where my data is stored. And I can click on the icon here and go to the location where my data is stored. In this example, I am loading a public data from the web for Scotland. I can proceed with open and I can show you where I got this data from. So I navigate the web for the bus open data and they do have information about GTFS data for different regions in the UK. There are different websites where you can get your GTFS data for other cities around the globe. I will go back to Bizum and check few information. I have the time period, which starts from this date to this date. I have my calendar defined as an annual calendar and few other information, which I will keep as default. Then I will proceed with OK, and Visum will start reading the GTFS data and convert it to a Visum format. Here we can see that Visum is reading the stop time text file and loading it into Visum, and then it will do the same for the different network objects. This process will take a few minutes for the data to be prepared and converted to Visum. I have already prepared another file where the data is loaded here. And we can see that I can run some analysis immediately on this data. For instance, here I calculate the isochrons at this stop area where it will give me information about the accessibility of this network. I can zoom out and look at the data imported. I have here all my stop points activated together with my public transport network. I can look at the different lines and line rules that has been imported. In this example, there is 8,900 line routes imported and around 1,900 lines. Each of these line routes contain information about the vehicle journeys, which will enable me to run a timetable based assignment. So for example, we can look at any of these lines, click on zoom, look at the line structure together with its stops. You can also visualize the timetable in a graphical view and look at each of these vehicle journey. So in this line, we have vehicles departing almost around 5 a.m. till 11 p.m. And this is the vehicle's journey timetable. I can see that it's not constant. And this is the sequence of the stops. I can now run further analysis, like calculating public transport skin matrix at the zone level or even at the stop area level. I can calculate shortest path from stop area to another stop area if needed. And they, I can also add my private transport network here and use the PUT supply import from Visum to map match my public transport data with my private transport data. So in this example, we managed to import GTFS data into Visum, quickly import it and convert it to a Visum readable format, which will help us 
to calculate further analysis for public transport. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our PTV Mobility channel. If you have any questions, please add them in the comment section below. Also, join us in our global community on LinkedIn by joining our PTV Visum forum in the link below. Thank you and see you in the next episode. Thank you.